Ed Austin, another opportunity, had a great week last week statistically. He didn't come out on top, but he threw for 318 yards. Good completion average bringing into this game, 60.5%. So he's been on the mark more than he's missed. He seems to be the people's choice in Regina, but the people would like to see a victory from number five. And the Riders start with a run. Milson Jones, who scored four touchdowns in the previous game, gets a good gain on first down. John Gregory, he said the offense had to make some adjustments in only one day of practice from last week. Milton Jones just simply steps laterally, sees Anderson pull around. He reads good job of reading Mike Anderson's block, cuts back up inside. Good solid seven-yard gain by Jones. It is second down and three. And it's Jones, and he carries a Winnipeg tackler for the first down. Then he tops it on the back of Milton Jones as the Riders run twice with the same back, just as the Bombers did for their first first down. Kent Austin quarterbacks, Tim McCray and Milson Jones are the starters, though you see Denny Ferdinand and David Conrad from time to time. Don Narcisse for Ray McDonald, the only change on offense for Saskatchewan. the afternoon already for him Mike Riley said the key he believes to today's game is intensity the team that can come out and stay as intense and physical for the whole football game should come out on top well he wonders about concentration he says uh, the schedule being what it is these days in the CFL a team cannot afford anything less than total concentration if it wants to win and he hopes and thinks the Bombers have it today. John Gregory feeling the same way about the Riders. Motivated to uh, atone for the last loss, the last minute loss. Flags come down as that pass was thrown nowhere near a Saskatchewan receiver and might have been intercepted by Ken Petway had he been able to adjust his footing. Early movement by the Saskatchewan Rough Riders. And a procedure called, declined by Winnipeg. Illegal procedure, Saskatchewan number 64, declined, third down. First punt for Terry Baker, we'll find James Jefferson or Gary Allen at the other end of it. Jefferson, the best kick returner in the CFL so far, certainly the best combined kick and punt returner, but I think he can make a good case for him either way, and this, is trouble for Saskatchewan. The Riders make sure it's not a Winnipeg touchdown and a fumble recovery, but it's going to be a Winnipeg first down, and the Bombers are going to be in great shape. The punt would have gone to Jefferson or Allen, but the punt never went anywhere. There's a hop, skip, and a jump here, and Terry Baker... Kind of gets himself looking up here, trying to hang on to the ball. Rod Hill does a nice job of not going for the ball, but getting Baker off.